go, boys. Here's the big bears in Northwest Alberta. <laughs> This week on the Archer's Choice. Wow, that was fast. I thought I'd just get in there real fast. Good job. This week we're down. up to Alberta. Alberta. Big Bear Country with Jason, Jason Packer. Jason Packer. That's right. Freddie and Joe. <laughs> okay, this week's Lucky Logo is new archery products. NAP, baby. You know why they call it NAP? No. Because when you use a Spitfire, a Thunderhead, a Hellraiser, a Kill Zone, any of them, the critters take a dirt nap. Mm -hmm. See, nap, NAP. If you happen to see the NAP logo, new archery product logo, at the end of the show, we'll tell you what to do with that. You're going to get a ton of good stuff. So now, we're going to yes, head up north. Head up north. Freddie and Alberta. Joe. Freddie Joe. Head up. Big Bear Country. Big Bears. Bearing down. Bearing down. Let's go. Alberta. Well, I'm going to gear our stuff up, throw it in the truck. Freddie and I got two more tags to burn here in Alberta. Big Bear Country with Steve Overgaard and Jason Packer. And, uh, man, they got the bears. Gosh, they got big bears, too. I'm telling you, everybody in camp, I think our smallest bear is like 6'4". And uh, there's six guys in camp. We're staying in a hotel, our own rooms, showers, phones, internet, TV. This is spoiling you for bear hunting. Spoiling you rot. All right, Fred, I got your bag, brother man. Sweet. Meet you in the truck. comes out of the sky, we may end up having to cut this on early because of the camera. Absolutely insane. 
insane. This boar came in and uh, the temperature's dropping. In a, we're hearing thunder. It's not a good sign. Now with camera equipment. So if what we're hearing comes out of the sky, we may end up having to cut this on early because of the camera. <laughs> Big bear country. <laughs> Holy smokes, Riley. <laughs> smoke. <sighs> that kill zone is crazy wicked. Oh. The old tracer rolling. Tell you what, I, uh, I hit that bear just a hair further back than I wanted, but either way, we heard him, he's done. He's done, right? He's right over here. I know he's back over there because I heard him, but let's see if we can find some blood. Oh yeah, look at here, Fred. Kill zone, baby, right there is a kill zone. Look at this, Fred. Oh, I guess I didn't hit him as far back as I thought I hit him. Jeez. This, uh, this place is nuts. Every time we're here, we have bears. We're covered with bears. We kill great bears up here in a whole camp. Everybody in camp is nearly tagged out. And I bet after tonight, the weather the way it is, we got some more bears to skin tomorrow. So we better get this guy off our back before he gets too close. But... Um, Jason, Steve, Ralph, Vicky, Freddie, Riley, thank you guys all so much. This place is nuts. I'm going to be dreaming about this for the next 360 days. And then some. <laughs> all right, man, we better get this one out of here, huh? Mm -hmm. Riley, thanks again, buddy. Appreciate it. It's just right out there circling the bay. Well, you see these gigantic broadheads I'm screwing on here and everybody's going, what are those things? That right there is an old school NAP Thunderhead 160. The reason I'm shooting these, it's in memory of my uncle Bubba who passed away about 10 years ago. And my aunt just recently came across one of his toolboxes that contained some of these broadheads. You can see the ferrules are in great shape. He had a whole pack of brand new blades so I figured what better way than to come up here and commemorate my uncle's memory than by killing a great big bear up here in Northwest Alberta with Big Bear Country Outfitters with one of his Thunderhead 160s. Now what's also cool about it is, is we're going to a completely new bait tonight that hasn't even been named yet by Jason and his guide. So if I'm lucky enough to kill a big bear tonight, I'm gonna to declare that bait Bubba's bait for the guys up here at Big Bear Country Outfitters. Yeah. <laughs> 
Oh my goodness, if you folks had smell a vision oh, oh man. Oh, that's horrible. That's bad enough to gag a maggot. I'm talking fast because we've been in the stand literally five minutes and here comes a bear right now. That's him. That's the big one. That is the big one. He's got the white blazes. He's just right out there circling the paint. He's down right there. And that one's for you, Bubba. That one's for you. Ooh, baby. Big Bear Country Outfitters, Northwest Alberta. I declare this Bubba's bait, son. Thank you, Lord. Praise Jesus. Oh, my goodness. Oh, my goodness. Oh, 
Oh, that's for you, bub. This is Bubba's Bait. Northwest Alberta, Big Bear Country Outfitters. This is Bubba's Bait from here on out. <laughs> so this is what we do in Northwest Alberta when we kill a big bear. <laughs> Celebration chocolate chip cookies, baby. Here's one for Joe. And Riley gets his. And I get mine. Here you go, boys. Here's the big bears in Northwest Alberta. <laughs> Gonna put Bubba's broadhead back into the quiver here because that will go with my mount of this bear and let's see he should be right up here right there he lays right here he lays <laughs> he's right here <laughs> he made it all of about 30 yards from where we shot him and oh my goodness. Look at how big this bear is. Look at the pads on him. Look at the blaze, Joe. Look at that. Just a big white stripe across his chest. This bear, I'd like to dedicate this bear to my uncle Bubba, Gary Davidson. The man that taught me how to be a man and to be a hunter. Taught me how to fish. Just taught me about life. Appreciate everything he ever did for me. And this one's for you, bub. This big bear right here is for you, my brother. I know you were with me here today in the stand. I gotta say thanks to Ralph and Vic for all the opportunities that they've given me over the years. Jason Packer and Steve Overgaard for inviting me back up again. Joe behind the camera, Riley, our guide, standing behind Joe. And of course, the good Lord above, because without him, oh, <laughs> this guy right here, would not exist. Thank you, Lord. God is good. Congratulations, Freddie. And Joe, He's that was- He's still emotional. That, oh, you know, and, well, that, that had a lot of, you know, what got him started mm -hmm. was Bubba. Yep, his Uncle Bubba. Yep, and and Bubba, he actually came to my bear camp years, and he, yep. he loved that Thunderhead 160. And, and Freddie had one. Yeah. That was pretty cool. Was I'm, really I'm cool. glad that Freddie still sheds tears. He's still our emotional one. Oh, yeah, yeah. It's He's pretty awesome. If you happen to see the new Archery product logo, which is the Lucky Logo. Yes, Spitfire's Thunderheads. That's right. Then Kill what you zones. need to do is log on to archerschoice.com, click on the Lucky Logo button, fill out some information. Someone's going to win a bunch of stuff. All from kinds of cool stuff. Plus all kinds of other stuff. That's true. Okay, next week? Next week. Oh, geez, Ralph. I think we should head up to North Dakota. To the branch, North Dakota. Double Big D bucks. Outfitters. That's right. Yeah, we can't wait. And well, thanks because. Because, because, because I really went nowhere yeah, okay, with that. Hey, thanks for watching this week's Archer's Choice. We'll see you next week. Same time. Same channel. Right because here on the Archer's, Archer's Choice. Choice. See, he can't on the show. He has no idea. I just, no clue. I, it's so much list. to my mind. It just, you know, Start I'm still to. hurt because, like you said the other week, that I wasn't invited. Well, not. So, that hurt. Down.